And what is Valentine's? I mean, they are, the origin, again, the issue of origin is, is sophisticated. But let us at least to say it is Roman adopted by the Christians. And either way, it is haram. And where does it come from? What is it really? Believe it or not, nowadays, you know, some couples, married couples, you know, they try to be, you know, funny and they, they, they celebrate Valentine's. But who is it mainly for? Boyfriend, girlfriend. That's what it's for. Men and women, actually some of these wild teenagers, if it's, you know, what is it, February the 14th? If it's February the 13th and they don't have someone, they just hook up with anyone. So the next day they will have a boyfriend or a girlfriend. It's like, I don't like him, but you know, maybe somebody will give me some flowers. So it's, what is this? Nonsense, you know? But this is the reality. This holiday is among the most wicked of all. A'udhu Billah. All you see is images of, uh, you know, uh, you know, hearts, you know, love and, you know, the Cupid and whatever, the arrow going from one side and going out from the other side and all this nonsense, man. And what it is, people trying to be loved. That's, it's, it's, a, it's an inferiority complex. It is like a, a mental disease. People love attention and love. So they just want to get some love and attention on any particular day. But a Muslim doesn't need that. What kind of love are you looking for? The love of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. If Allah loves you, who cares about everybody else? That's what we should really aim for. Now if the people love us because Allah loves us, Alhamdulillah. But we try to have people love us even though Allah doesn't love us, this is no good love. So I'm not going to give you the, the history of Valentine's. Let's just say it sucks. And from now on, woe to you from writing a card or receiving a card or even putting a silly picture on Facebook supporting or, or, or acknowledging this holiday in any way, shape or form. It's a holiday where people commit zina, where people wind up disobeying Allah, where, where people who are not married engage in things that only married people engage in. All these are unacceptable Islamic abhorrent sins. Abhorrent sins. في صومي وصلاتي ودعائي للرحمن وجميع الطاعات